trying to be serious. <laughs> I just found myself singing in a video. I'm super trans and gay and uh, <laughs> I guess this was the best part of my day <laughs> so far. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> so seriously, hey folks, I'm so happy to be here again and um, yes, I guess some guys of you might have questions, where have I been, what have I been doing and am I okay? Especially after the last video I just uploaded and it's like months ago. So yeah, obviously there are many things that have changed. Uh, first of all, as you can see, my background has totally changed. Uh, right at the moment I'm sitting on my bed. Uh, as I found out, this is the best position for filming in this kind of flat because behind the camera I have a whole front of big windows and much lightning and there's no no way to sit on my chair, sit at my desk uh, and uh, do the filming. I'm still laughing <laughs> about this. Okay, uh, you, you will see it at the end of the of the video. I, I will put it uh, within there. What happened after the last video, which I recorded in November? Um, first of all, I think I recorded during the last few months like four or five videos which I didn't upload for many reasons and the video I just uploaded it is the only one I still have I think the other ones I just erased them all um, so I'm I'm sorry so I guess I have to start from the beginning again to tell you what my life was all about back then. First of all, after being four months at home and starting to work again, I think at in the middle of November, um, I found it pretty hard to get back to work. And with all these questions I had in my head back then, it was pretty clear that I needed something like a new start. I needed uh, a new job. That was the first thing I was pretty sure of. So I quit my job by the end of the year and I tried to find something uh, in the city I lived in or at least nearby, but it didn't work at all. But I had some job offers in Hamburg. So it was pretty clear that I have to move to Hamburg, find a new flat in this wonderful but really expensive city where it's kind of impossible to find a new flat. But I got one, I'm really happy. I have a one room flat with a balcony and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm super happy, super okay with this one. Um, I can afford it. And I found a really cool job at a school and I was working with kids, mostly between the first and the fourth grade. Um, it was kind of educational stuff uh, in the morning lessons and also uh, every every afternoon I was in school uh, just to do stuff with them. Uh, like I had two different line dance groups and I was, um, yeah, I was dancing with kids and yeah, it was all pretty fun. I, I really liked it. But uh, then I got fired. I think this happened like some weeks ago. It was not a really nice thing um, and it was not really nice how it all happened. So, but um, I just accepted it and I said, okay, you know what, thanks for nothing, then bye. Um, because I, I don't have the time to be, to be sad about it because, uh, well, I need to find a new job <laughs> to afford my life. So there's no time, time to be depressed. So right now I'm just looking for something new in somewhere in the social sector or even um, going back to church or whatever. Just something something social. Um, it would be nice if my next job could also be with uh, kids or with teams or uh, something like project management or um, yeah. 
So I'm really, I'm really open about anything that comes right along. As I told you in my last vid, it was a really hard time last year for me. Yeah, it was. Um, but I think uh, I'm okay. So really, yeah, I mean it. Not only that my body has healed in a wonderful way, but also I think like um, mentally I'm really, really okay. So I'm I'm happy. I'm happy quite now where I am in the city, even without a job right now. Yeah, I'm totally happy. I even found some new friends in town. It took me some time to uh, to go out and explore the city and to find out, okay, what what can I do in such a big city just to make new friends and what do I need to do? So, um, I started to think about working for a, a non-profit organization like HIV and STI prevention and yeah, I'm I'm doing this and uh, just this week we have like pride week here in Hamburg so this afternoon I have to go to work <laughs> so with uh, some of my colleagues it helped me just to get in contact with some people um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. I really like this kind of um, working. Yeah, you can't really call it work. Because after some hours, we can all just stay at, at the parties for free and just be there and hang around with the guys. And yeah, so I really like that. It's a cool way to get into the gay community in a city where everything's possible. So that's something I really... Uh, haven't experienced before and also what I really like about Hamburg is the queer community I also got in touch with tons of wonderful lovely people and it's so and it's so heartwarming every time I see them it's just like a whole big family of wonderful women and men and human beings and I just love to be with them and spending time with them and sharing life experience and taking part in discussions and preparing events and yeah that's really really cool so I think this whole process like I need a new start and I think I have to quit my job and I think I have to move again so it was all it was all pretty rough and it took most of my energy um but it was worth it it was so worth it i'm really really happy and yeah i have no idea how long i will live in this city because maybe as you know um, i like to move a lot <laughs> but for now i'm just here and i'm happy and um yeah, I have I have so many things on my video list. Uh, I have no idea when to film all this stuff, but I'm really trying. Okay, so just please give me a little bit of time. I just wanted to tell you that I'm fine. I'm okay. I'm um, happy. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to share this with you. It's just that I'm super excited to film a new video. It's even that I can hear it in my voice that that uh, the pitch is going higher again because I'm I'm so excited and uh, yeah I really I really missed this. Well, that's awesome. So okay, um, thanks for now. I hope to see you soon, guys. And thanks for watching. Bye. I'm talking like bullshit. Yeah, I don't know.